So hey y'all, good morning. It is early on a Sunday morning and I am in the headquarters for the Pollux and Maxi fan club. Look at this. Can you all see all of these shirts laid out on my dining room table? I'm sorry for the hairdo y'all. <laughs> Maxi, what are you doing? What are you doing? He, he wants to be in the video. Look here, Mary. <laughs> Sweet boy. But this morning, the dogs and I and Randy are starting the process of shipping out all of your fan club tees. This is gonna be a massive undertaking. So Friday, I got word from our screen printer, and of course we used, let me sit down, maybe, come here, come here. We used a local screen printer here in our hometown to print all of the t-shirts. I got word from him Friday morning that the shirts were ready. So I said, hold on, I'm putting on my shoes, I'm coming as is, and I want to get the shirts. So off I went. So I've got them home, Brecken and I unboxed everything, counted and sorted all of the colors by v-neck by crew neck by size all of the stuff and then today we are starting the shipping process is that the shirts boo are you checking them all out <gasps> that's the shirts <laughs> that's your shirts boo that's your fan club t-shirt so look at this y'all, t-shirts are taking over our dining room. Massive amounts of fan club tees. But look how cute everything is. They turned out perfectly. There's the Welcome to My Curls logo on the sleeve. Perfect, love it. What do you think about it, Pollux? Is this a bunch of tees? Huh? Are we messing with your dining room table? It's your hiding spot. <laughs> Dude, I'm trying to work up here. So Maxie and Pollux, right, Mooey Moos, <laughs> are so excited that you are part of the fan club and we hope that you received our email that we sent out um, the day we picked up the shirts. We sent all the fan club members an email letting you know that we had the shirts, we were starting the shipping process, and we sent you some behind the scene pictures of the little secret surprise that's going in all of the shirts from Maxie and Pollux. They were prepping. They got their part totally finished and ready for me to use. And so we included some behind the scenes pictures. If you checked your email, you got a little snippet of the special little something that the dogs put together for you. What you doing? Putting dog treats from Maxie and Pollux in their bags. Oh, Pollux is sniffing them, checking them out. Don't eat them, buddy. <laughs> he just checking them out. He giving the approval. He's a supervisor. He got to put a final stamp on everything. Show us the treats you put in there. Their favorite treats. Peanut butter treats. <laughs> wow, you got all those extra treats left over you get to eat. This is inside everybody's little t-shirt order. <laughs> you like a smell them? Okay. Do you approve, Pollux? But normally, I ship shirts out of my office. Well, I don't have room in my office for all of these t-shirts, and so I gotta figure out the system that I'm gonna use for all of these shirts. This is something. My printer's upstairs in my office, which I need to print the shipping labels and the packing slips, but I need room. Like I had to spread everything out down here in the dining room. So fan club, y'all have taken over my dining room, literally. What you doing, boo? So Pollux and I have a funny story for you. Yesterday morning, I had all of the t-shirts laid out on the dining room table, just like you saw. We get up out of bed in the morning. Pollux is so super skippy in the mornings. So the minute we come out of the bedroom, Pollux always grabs his favorite toy 
and takes it outside into the yard. And his favorite toy at the moment is this big donut that he's torn to pieces. So he took the donut out in the yard, they go potty, and they come inside to eat their breakfast. Maxie eats first and Pollux has to wait. There's a whole story behind that, not gonna get into it, but Pollux has to wait. So while Maxie is eating, Pollux always goes and gets another toy and runs around the house with it while Maxie is eating his breakfast. So I hear Pollux up in the front room, wrestling around, digging around for whatever toy he wants that morning. And he comes running past me and I saw what he had in his mouth and I yelled, no! Pollux had it come into the dining room and jumped up on the dining room table with his little needle nose and grabbed the entire pile of white fan club t-shirts and was gonna run outside with them, all of the white t-shirts. Well, as soon as I yelled, he stopped, he dropped the t-shirts, and I was able to get them and bring them back into the dining room. But I discovered that along the way, he had dropped half of the white t-shirts in the front room with his toy box. So anyway, if you ordered a white Pollux and Maxi t-shirt, you may find a little dog hair on it. I'm sorry, he wanted to help. He was super excited. The whole time, Brecken and I were unboxing and counting all of these shirts on Friday. The dogs were so interested in what we were doing that they have never seen this kind of activity in our dining room. But that's my funny little story. But today, I'm gonna start the shipping process and I wanted to include you. And we wanted to say thank you for being part of the fan club. So here we go. Let's get these shirts in the mail. Is that your favorite toy today, Pollux? The peanut butter femur bone? Are you gonna help me with the t-shirts? You're going to, yay! You're gonna help me with the t-shirts. Everybody wants Pollux here in their t-shirt. <laughs> Come on, we got work to do, Bubby. We can't be chewing bones and playing. We got work to do. Mooey. Are you excited to have all of these fans, Mooey? Huh? Y'all so excited. Oh my goodness to me. Okay, well let's get to it. How are we gonna do this? Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're getting the booty going. I have everything sorted. The easiest way for me to do it is V-necks on one side, crew necks on the other, and so it's small, medium, large, extra large, 2X and 3X in each color. So we got the charcoal gray, we have military green, same thing over here in white, and then we have all of the blues. So yeah, this is happening y'all in my dining room. Are you hot now, Pollux? So I'm learning that the online shopping platform that I use will only let me print or prepare 20 orders at a time. Groups of 20 is my max. So I'm printing off all the packing slips, coming in here, getting all the shirts together, putting them in the stack, and then every 20, I'm gonna package them up. I think that's gonna be my process, but right now, can y'all see this? Mm -hmm. That's my helper right now. No help, totally in the way. Maxie's decided to take a Judy. This is too much for him. Randy went to get me lunch. So, y'all, nobody is helping me. Brecken's not here. Randy went to get lunch. Pollux is sound asleep under the dining room table, and Maxie's in the living room. It's just all me, y'all. It is all me. Really? You're going to lay right there so I can't go by? Like, really? These are package orders. I'm getting them together one by one, and I'm starting to create a stack. Mooey, why aren't you helping me, Moo? It's just too much for you. You're gonna keep it safe too. Uh, what? I could use some assistance, you two. This is your fan club after all. 
getting out more toys. It's not playtime, Pollux. It's work time. Y'all see this hole in the blanket? Pollux did that with his needle nose. Oh. I hear him. I hear him. Guys, he wants to sit back in the pound. <laughs> They're waiting. It's lunchtime. They've been working hard, they said. Lunch break. It's funny that we're actually having Taco John's for lunch because in the video, the very first video about Pollux, where I told you all that we adopted Pollux, it was New Year's Day and Randy went to Taco John's to get us lunch and so many of you all commented that you love Taco John's or you'd been through the South and had Taco John's and wish you had it where you lived. It's kind of ironic that we're having Taco John's today and we're packing up their fan club teeth. If you don't know what Taco John's is, it's fast food Mexican, but it's really good fast food Mexican. Beef taco. These are called potato lays with cheese dip. Randy always gets the chips and he gets a hard shell taco. Well, look, he wearing his fan club tee. And look, he's right here wanting a potato lay. You gonna give him a potato lay, Dad? Oh, Max or get a tater ole. And Pollux get one too. Anytime Pollux gets a food, he takes it in the living room, drops it on the carpet, inspects it, and decides if he's gonna eat it or not. He doesn't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you ate it? You went for it? And Maxer says he got no problem with it. being the best helper Pollock right now. He smells the treats that are going into the t-shirts and that's why he's in here. Huh, is that what you're smelling, boo? Yeah, you say hi to everybody. Yeah, plus it's dinner time. He getting hungry. Dinner break.
Do y'all see my helper? Look. On the couch. Here comes my helper, Paul. He's been with me all day long underneath the table helping. Are you ready for your dinner? Okay. There you go. Pollux gets his dinner. Dinner time. Come on, Boo. Go, Pollux. Go, party. Come on, Boo. Come on, go, party. Go. Do, do. Go, go. Go. Where's Pollux? Oh, there he is. Everybody just milling around out here. Goodness. Well, everybody was super helpful today. These two, Maxie and Pollux, were helpful. I got about mm, 10 minutes out of help from Randy, and then you see where he is. He is asleep on the couch. Brecken has not been here, so it's just been the dogs and I packaging up all of the fan club teas. But that's fine. We've enjoyed doing it. I've got... I've got a good chunk of them done at this point. A good chunk that I'll take to the post office in the morning to drop off and... I'll just keep going tomorrow. I think it's probably gonna take me a couple days to get all the shirts out. That is what we're doing in the Hayden house. Well, thank you to everybody who bought a fan club t-shirt. This has been a lot of fun. If you missed your chance, keep your eye out because we are coming out with long sleeve t-shirts and hoodies very, very soon. It is Monday morning, and y'all, I worked until 9.30 last night on these t-shirts. It took me a while to just get my process figured out. What was the best way to do things? What was the best order? But now, I got it. So, it should be smooth sailing from here. But it's Monday morning. I had to come to the ice cream shop. I've got, I got to clean on Mondays and do stuff. But anyway, so I've got a whole box of shirts. Woo, yep. In the back seat, I'm personally delivering them to my post office so they will get to you pronto. But I think this is probably going to take me mm, maybe all week. I don't know. I have a lot of shirts to get out. But I'm going to go to the ice cream shop, do what I got to do, drop these shirts off. I have a bunch of errands. Got to go to the grocery. And y'all, Brecken is leaving for college in two days. So there is that. I have to go home and do a bunch of college packing this afternoon. And then we're heading to Lexington in two days to get her moved in. So there is one day this week where I can't work on the shirts. So sad. Anyway, but I'm going to drop these shirts off, do my thing, head back home, and finish working on the shirts. And I have some shout outs for you all when I get home. So let's go back home because we have a lot more to do. And I'm going to give you some more behind the scenes. <laughs> y'all, we're busy working. What are y'all doing? Hey, you two. You're supposed to be helping us. Yeah, you're supposed to be helping us do fan club shirts. My little helper, y'all. B-girl, leaving for college in two days. Yep. yep. But she's helping. And we still have all these to do. <laughs> oh, you want to play too? <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're not getting work done, y'all, when we're playing. 
Get her, movie. Go get him, Pox. Go get him. Here, Pox. Okay, I have another hand. Oh, Max is getting his big girl love in before she leaving. Big girl loving. No, he being sweet. He being all sweet. Pox, you keep putting your big nose in the picture. <laughs> He's once his booty rubbed. <laughs> Can you move that booty? <laughs> Oh, Mooey. Are you going to miss your big girl? Oh. oh, oh okay. <laughs> uh, oh he's putting his booty on him. Pollux wants a booty scrub. Somebody's going to get hurt here. <laughs> booty scrubs. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, let's get to work. We got work to do, Pollux. You're holding up progress, buddy. Come on, let's get to work. We got work to do. Okay, come on. So look who I have helping me. B girl's helping me. <laughs> but anyway, I want to give a huge shout out to our giveaway winner. Connie won a free tea. Thank you so much, Connie, for joining the fan club and buying a tea, and we hope that you love your free tea. So we're going to continue on doing what we're doing, packaging, shipping, putting in special little things from Pollux and Maxi, writing notes, and I hope that you all love your teas when you get them. If you ordered a tea, please comment below and let me know what you think. Is there something that you would have liked to have seen done differently? Did you appreciate the time and effort that we put into your order? I really hope that you do. But yeah, we have a lot to do. So we're just going to keep on going, guys. But thank you all for watching and spending some time in the Pollux and Maxi Fan Club Warehouse, aka our dining room. I'll see you later.